This is the evolution of the computer mouse brought to you by Allison McMath. There is little doubt that most of you don't know what a computer mouse is. Some of us can't bear the thought of using a computer without one under our hand. The computer mouse has seen great change, but one wonders if one day it might disappear altogether. In the 1960s, a relatively unknown inventor, Douglas Engelbart, wanted to create a way for people to interact with a computer screen. With the help of Bill English, a pioneer of human-computer interaction, he came up with all sorts of ideas, one including a giant metal trackball and a knee-operated device. While these devices never came to fruition, they also lacked speed and accuracy, unlike his personal favorite, a mouse, which was nothing more than a carved block of wood with some electronics inside. In September 1972, Engelbart's project partner, Bill English, built the Rollerball Mouse. It could navigate a pointer around the screen with ease, and it was so successful that despite advances in technology, you can still buy a basic no-frills Rollerball Mouse today. Here is an inside view of the Rollerball Mouse, where you can see the Rollerball, which would be used to navigate your computer screen. The Rollerball Mouse has gradually been phased out over the past 10 years, replaced by the Optical Mouse, and more recently the Laser Mouse. Both these types beat the Rollerball Mouse hands down. You don't require a rubber mat for either one of them. With the Optical Mouse, the Rollerball was replaced by an LED light or laser, which creates almost pinpoint accuracy on your computer screen. Now mice are even made with laser pointing beams to be used in lectures or business meetings. The mouse has even come as far as to function somewhat like a Wii gaming remote. Logitech released a mouse recently that uses gyroscopic technology so that you can make changes to any applications in Windows Vista by moving your arms around. We started with the single button mouse, then went to the double button mouse, and somehow we found our way to three buttons. And now you can even find mice with five buttons and more. Mice often with five buttons or more are often tailored for the use of computer gaming today. They even make mice that look like your favorite car. Or how about a panda bear? Or even a mouse that looks like a ladybug. Although many of us do love the control of our mouse, one has to wonder with the evolution of such concepts like the iPhone type computer and the tablet Mac PC, all used with just one touch of your finger, if the good old trusty mouse might just one day be gone.